The Turkish defense industry continues to expand its reach by strengthening cooperation in the Middle East region, one of which is with Kuwait. The latest step in this cooperation was marked by the official visit of the president of the Turkish defense industry, Professor Dr. Haluk Gergen, to Kuwait. During the visit, Professor Gergen met with Kuwait's Deputy Chief of General Staff, Major General Sheikh Sabah Jaber, Al Ahmad Al Sabah, and Deputy Minister of Defense, Sheikh Dr. Abdullah Mashal Mubarak Al Sabah. The meeting aimed to strengthen strategic relations and expand cooperation in the development of defense technology between the two countries. The meeting between the two parties reflects the seriousness of Turkey and Kuwait in expanding collaboration in the defense sector, Turkey has become one of Kuwait's important partners in this field, providing various advanced defense systems that meet the needs of the Kuwaiti military. Professor Gergun's visit is expected to accelerate the technology transfer process and open up new opportunities in the development and joint production of defense systems. Kuwait, as a country that relies heavily on foreign defense, attaches importance to the development of military technology by involving experienced and technologically advanced international partners, such as Turkey. On the other hand, Turkey seeks to strengthen its strategic position in the Gulf region, especially through defense diplomacy that allows for closer ties with countries such as Kuwait. In this context, Professor Gergen's visit is a concrete step to strengthen bilateral relations amidst regional geopolitical uncertainty. Professor Gergen said that Turkey is ready to provide full support in helping Kuwait achieve technological independence in the defense sector. One of the important aspects of the meeting was the potential for cooperation in the manufacture of combat equipment, air defense systems, and cyber technology. Turkey hopes to become a major partner for Kuwait in increasing military technology capacity and strengthening defense systems. During the visit, the two sides signed a Memorandum of Understanding containing an action plan to enhance defense cooperation. The memorandum includes a commitment to conduct joint training for Kuwaiti military personnel at Turkish military training facilities, as well as improving technical skills in the defense technology sector. This is part of Turkey's efforts to support Kuwait in building national capacity in the field of military technology. Turkey, which has succeeded in developing national defense technology, such as drones, air defense systems, and ground combat vehicles, is now one of the countries trusted by various countries in the Middle East region, including Kuwait. With this cooperation, Turkey hopes to contribute more to the stability and security of the region. On the other hand, Kuwait sees this opportunity as an effort to reduce dependence on suppliers from outside the region and strengthen its ability to defend the country's sovereignty. Turkey also offers various training programs and specialist courses for Kuwaiti military personnel which is expected to increase the professionalism and operational capabilities of the Kuwaiti Armed Forces, as well as strengthen intelligence and security networks in the region. Professor Gergen emphasized that Turkey is fully committed to providing technological support and expertise so that Kuwait can develop independent capabilities in the military field. This cooperation also includes opportunities for the Turkish defense industry to collaborate with local Kuwaiti companies, which is expected to provide economic benefits for both countries and support the creation of new jobs in the defense sector. Sheikh Abdullah stressed the importance of this cooperation for Kuwait's economic development and saw it as part of the country's economic diversification strategy. In addition, this visit also provided an opportunity for the two countries to discuss security challenges in the region, especially amidst the dynamic geopolitical situation.
Kuwait and Turkey share the same view on the importance of regional security and hope that this cooperation can be a foundation for creating a safer and more stable environment in the Middle East region. Through this visit, Turkey and Kuwait have demonstrated their commitment to working together to achieve the goal of a stronger and more independent defense. With the concrete steps that have been taken, it is hoped that the defense industry cooperation between Turkey and Kuwait will become stronger, thus bringing benefits to regional stability and the welfare of the people of both countries. Turkey hopes to become a major partner for Kuwait in increasing military technology capacity and strengthening defense systems. The memorandum includes a commitment to conduct joint training for Kuwaiti military personnel at Turkish military training facilities, as well as improving technical skills in the defense technology sector. Turkey, which has succeeded in developing national defense technology, such as drones, air defense systems, and ground combat vehicles, is now one of the countries trusted by various countries in the Middle East region, including Kuwait. On the other hand, Kuwait sees this opportunity as an effort to reduce dependence on suppliers from outside the region and strengthen its ability to defend the country's sovereignty. Professor Gurgan emphasized that Turkey is fully committed to providing technological support and expertise so that Kuwait can develop independent capabilities in the military field. Sheikh Abdullah stressed the importance of this cooperation for Kuwait's economic development and saw it as part of the country's economic diversification strategy. Kuwait and Turkey share the same view on the importance of regional security and hope that this cooperation can be a foundation for creating a safer and more stable environment in the Middle East region. With the concrete steps that have been taken, it is hoped that the defense industry cooperation between Turkey and Kuwait will become stronger, thus bringing benefits to regional stability and the welfare of the people of both countries. Kuwait and Turkey share the same view on the importance of regional security and hope that this cooperation can be a foundation for creating a safer and more stable environment in the Middle East region.